are listening to idolradioshow.com. With your amazing host, Daryl. Daryl, 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 Daryl. So, Brittany, I started um, talking a couple weeks ago. <clears throat> well, probably more like a, a couple months ago is when I started thinking about it. And maybe like a month or so, um, we had uh, Jay on here, Jay Styles. And he had that, you know, what happens to music. And, and it's like since then I've been on this kick about just music. You know, right. I'm really into just music. And um, you kind of like took that to heart <laughs> and started a new MySpace page. And the MySpace, the new MySpace, is connected to our MySpace. So anybody who's listening who goes to our MySpace, shoot over to there and uh, click on the very first name, or either you can go to the URL. What, what's the what's the uh, link to um, to the new space? It's at, yeah, I got it right here. I'm sorry, but it's myspace.com forward slash bringing real music back. I was telling somebody before Dreamgirls came out for the younger people, Beyonce was like the stand, like no, not the standard. <laughs> she wasn't the standard. She was the plateau for most young people of um of what real singing was. So yeah, when they heard Beyonce, not, but. You know. Well, I'm saying when people heard Beyonce, that's what they thought. Like, that was about as high as they thought it could get. And Alicia Keys. Alicia Keys is the bomb. Yeah, but she's, yeah, she is. Not as popular, right. Yeah, she's not as popular. But she doesn't, she, I mean, you, you, there's still differences there. You know, like a lot of people would say that, that she has her own style, which is great. <clears throat> but um, um, she's she's really She's a music person, but a lot of people say, like, you know, she doesn't have, like, the range that so many other people have. I mean, if you want to just talk about pure range, Beyonce has more range than she does. Um, wow. I don't know. I could, might, I might get killed for saying that, too, to be honest. Somebody, I might walk out tomorrow. Yeah, we'll be talking later. Yeah, and, well, you can't argue with the range part, Brett. You might say, I mean, you might, you might be able to come back and say range doesn't matter, but you're not going to be able to tell me that. Beyonce has a... Um, you, wait, no, 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 no. There's no way in the world that you think that Alicia Keys has more range than Beyonce. Where's Idol Observer? I need him to call in just to clarify this because I'm a little, I, I don't know. Yeah, you know what? We do need the Idol Observer. If, if you're listening, if you could please call in and settle this argument. Mm-hmm. Um, because this is, this, is, this is insane. This is what you're saying you need to be arrested for. Wow. So I love Alicia Keys, though. I'm not saying anything bad about her. But what are you saying, that Alicia Keys is a, is a better vocalist or a better singer than Beyonce? Absolutely, vocal. You are out of your mind. Are you kidding me? There, are you serious? No, I'm being completely serious right now. You are out you think of your Beyonce mind. Beyonce has more vocal talent. I love Beyonce. Please don't get me wrong, but you think she has more vocal talent than Alicia Keys? Yes, I like Alicia Keys better than I like Beyonce, though. But she, wow. Yeah, I mean, I, their styles, their personalities. I like what well, their singing styles. I have not met Alicia. No, I like Alicia Keys so much more, but I, I, I can't say that she has more range. You you think she has more range? I, I have to check. I have to check it out. I just know that her vocal talent is more is better. There's, what? Like she she? I don't know. Um, okay. Hold, hold that thought, cause I, I I'm I'm gonna go check. I'm gonna go do my research. But I'm pretty sure that at least she can hold it down a little bit better than Beyonce yes, can. I could be crazy. Okay. Yeah. We might have to get you away from that from that group that you're doing, because um, you you have um. You have absolutely, you have absolutely lost it, I'll like yeah, completely. Yeah. We got to do some uh, news in a minute with Omar, but a few a little while ago we were talking about the bringing back real music with Britney, and I want to just talk to Britney for a second because we had a slight argument. Britt, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. We had a slight argument the other day. This Jay Styles guy, you know, we 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 support him on the Idol Radio Show, but I think that I'm real close to banning him from the show because. <laughs> Our very own Brit has fallen in love with this guy. I am in love with Jay Styles. And I'm just telling you, you know, his talent I'm is in love with you. Is, his know. talent is not so great that we're going to allow him to take our Brit away from us. Uh, Jay Styles, welcome to the Outer Radio Show. Hey, what's going on, man? How are you? I'm doing all right. I would like you to meet our, the first lady of the Outer Radio Show, uh, Brit. Brit, meet Jay Styles. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> hey, Jay. What's going on? Now, Jay, I appreciate I appreciate your calling in. You know, were you inspired? a whole thing that we're doing right now, bringing back real music. And we have a MySpace uh, page that's up to that name. And um, um, it's become real popular in a short period of time. I think that a lot of people, when they're listening to what they're hearing on the radio these days, they're not seeing or hearing real music anymore. I mean, and, and, and you made, you know, you had the whole bringing back 
music, uh, what happened to music uh, uh, theme song. In fact, he he recently, you know, you recently put it up as a. Um, you actually went to the studio and recorded it, right? Yeah, yeah. I actually put it up on my page. Yeah. And and I mean, it's like because we originally when we brought it in, we had it, um, we had it as just you know you were doing it with the with the camera, and and now you know we got it. Some nice music going on behind it. What's happened to music? What's happened to it? This is what's up. Um, what's happened to? What 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 has happened to it? Man, I have no clue. I, I I actually I shouldn't say I have no clue. I what really happened is music had went from being something that everybody depended on for in for inspiration and stuff like that. It went from being something so I don't even what I don't even know what word I'm looking for. Something so innocent and something so pure to being something that everybody wanted to do just for money and just it's been contaminated I guess yeah and and I think a lot of people just go in the studio and make songs just for the dollar and they don't think like I, I don't call a single out anybody names or nothing like that but a lot of these younger cats are looking at it just for a right now thing yeah and the old singers and stuff I think they was in it for the long run I think when they went in to record and stuff they thought for the future, like, this is something that I want to keep doing, not just this one hit. And, and I think a lot of the mentality the mentality now is let's just make a hit and that's it. Or let's just make something that's going to make us a good check and, and that's it. And then there's no effort into it. Once they get comfortable, then it's just like they just lay back and just play around with it. And, I, and I'm real sensitive about it because I love music and any time I've ever been in a situation or anything, music has played a big part in bringing me out or helping me see the light. Right. And right. I, I mean, and it's just that I was, I was actually at home with my nephew and my cousin on yesterday, and we was we were watching TV, and I was noticing all the commercials. Everything has music in it, and we don't even realize how how big of a role music plays in just how we respond to stuff. Yeah. And every little thing, the music actually adds so much. It, it's just, I don't know. I, I, I I can go on and on for days. <laughs> but. Yeah. Well, I mean, you 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 definitely are. Um, I think now pioneering pioneering um, a, a new thing. And I mean, uh, all joking aside, you really were the inspiration for this new oh, <clears throat> group that that we started on MySpace, and it really really has taken off. And we're going to be featuring artists on the MySpace page every week, and then um, uh, we'll be playing whatever artists we feature on our show every week, and uh, we'll be taking one artist out of that per month and uh, bringing them on the Idol Radio Show just to have a little chat with them and all of those people uh, will be informed that they can thank you. Well, I'm glad that I can help, man, because you know what? This actually encourages me even more to know that people are actually seeing what my vision is and this is what I'm trying to do and I always tell people when they ask me, what do you want to do with music? I want to be a part of the movement. I want to be a part of setting the bar saying this is not acceptable. Not not to say anybody's not good or not not to judge nobody or nothing, but just to say, hey, we're gonna step it up. We're gonna do this right. right. Just so that the people that allowed us to be here would want to turn on the radio and say, yeah, I'll listen to the radio or yeah, yeah I'll go out and buy a CD. Because right now they're not doing that. They don't want to hear nothing. They they don't. We had Vesta Williams on our show uh, last Thursday, and Vesta was saying that, you know, they play those three or four songs on rotation every every. Um, um, 20 minutes. They just are constantly playing the same songs. <laughs> All right, so thank you. Stay in touch with us, and any time that you are uh, appearing any place, uh, let us know so we can let the, let the people know. Check it out. I have on MySpace page. I got a show on June the 8th. I'll let you go and look on MySpace and check it out. I'll be setting that up. MySpace.com forward slash more than just music, and music is with a Q. Yes, thank you guys. Everybody. Thank you, Jay.